snakes to lure out my plan is thus you will inform the coral snakes of the empress's location a false one of course tell them that you have her in your custody and that if they wish to confirm her identity they must come to the empty abode south along flamebearer palace road it is my hope that this will lure the mastermind to the fall to share information with the coral snakes to lure out our foe. And mayhap the jail is our best avenue for this. Ah, yes, I know just where to find this person. Follow me. Well, now, isn't this lucky? Someone who knows the way. So we've finally arrived. I thought we shall wait here. Till your business is done. Pfft. What do you want? You've got the Empress. This some kind of jape? Suppose the fact you're telling this to me means you're in the know. You one of us. Right then. I'll pass these tidings along to our... Interested party. Where should I tell them to find you? The empty house south of the Pilgrim's Path, is it? Fair enough. Fear not. I'll arrange for the interested party to meet you in the empty house south of the Pilgrim's Path. Sir Arisen, I take it you have given the Coral Snakes the information we discussed, then the villain behind Her Majesty's assassination will doubtless be compelled to act with all due haste. And so must we. Let us begin our preparations presently. Might I implore you to play the part of a bandit, Sir Arisen? As one of Her Majesty's champions, my face is like as not to be known to our villain. I have also employed the aid of a woman resembling Her Majesty in stature and build. She will fulfill the role of Empress during the exchange. No, Manella. We must go ourselves, Your Majesty. I don't think... Should the ruse be discovered too soon, the Renegade may flee and escape justice. We must confront them, so that our land and its people may ne'er endure such uncertainty again. Understood. Then I shall guard your majesty with my life. We must needs be ready for whatever comes, Sir Arisen. Pray, tell me when you are prepared. It seems you are called upon to act alone, so we pawns shall join your audience. I do hope you play your part well. Rest on, wouldn't you say, master? I suspect the villain will approach under cover of night. Are your preparations concluded? I am glad to hear it, and not a moment too soon. We have received word that someone approaches our location. Find a way to loosen the villain's tongue. I shall remain hidden till the opportune moment presents itself. May all go as planned. I am come. Would you kindly open the door? 
Let us not waste time. I am here to confirm the identity of your captive and naught else. Where might she be? Indeed, tis the Empress and none other, fortunately for you. Had it been anyone else, your head would now be free of its shoulders. Tis by the Coral Snakes' failure that she yet lives. I trust you are prepared to rectify this mistake. Go on, kill her. That is far enough. You must forgive me. I suspected foul dealings from the moment I heard the Empress was being held here. However, with this display you have earned my trust. In truth, she cannot die here. We must have her meet her, and in a place more fitting. Tell me, do you know what it takes to inspire action in this world? Tragedy. Yes, tragedy. The emotion that floods forth in the wake of such events can change the world entire. Consider what a tragedy of singular measure, such as that of a great leader martyred for her ideals could achieve. Why? The flames of revolution would burn eternal. A worthy funeral pyre for an empress, wouldn't you agree? And so Her Majesty's tragedy must be made a spectacle of, that all Batal might bear witness and shed tears of blood. So this was your aim. It all becomes clear. On your knees, we have you surrounded. Sir Armhild! So it was you! Manella, this little ruse was your doing, I suppose. And as for your majesty, I must say I am disappointed. You would go so far to save your own neck, rather than do what is best for the future of this country. We understand what you desired to achieve. Yet we also believe that no ideal can truly be born from bloodshed. Perhaps you will ponder this in your solitude. By our authority as Empress, we hereby place you under arrest. Sir Armhild's was a vile plot. I only hope she is the last villain seeking to advance her aims through murder. The matter is concluded. Who could ask for more? We pity Ermhild, but her ideals are not our own. We do not believe that Batal would be best served by a martyred empress. I shall escort Sir Ermhild to her cell. I cannot thank you enough for your aid in this matter, Sir Arisen. Follow me. That fool understands naught. Does she think she can exact change in this world through goodwill alone? Follow me, Arisen! 